Hi, good morning children. How are you? I hope you are all fine. Welcome to Nirbhaya High School, Padmanaga Phase 2, Chintan. Digital Learning Classes to understand the subject easily. I am your English teacher, Astralakshmi Ma'am. Hi children, yesterday we have learned the lesson reading, no? We have done our lesson reading, yes? Today now we are, I am going to explain you the lesson. What is the lesson number children? Lesson number 10, the A Trip to Shanti Niketan. A Trip to Shanti Niketan. Here, see your children, what it is about a trip that Rukmi went on with her parents. Okay children, everyone take out your page number 17. It was the first day of my winter holidays. Every winter we planned road trips to explore new places. It is my family's favorite time to travel. Here Rukmi is telling that it was her first day of winter holidays. And every every winter they will be planning the road trips. They will be planning the road trips to explore the new places. This time their family's favorite time to travel. The family's favorite time is to travel. Now see, I remember last December on a cold morning, we began our journey to Shanti Niketan. Did I tell you that Shanti Niketan is about 100 kilometers away from my hometown? Understood, children? See here, it remem I remember last December. Okay, on a cold morning, they will begin to journey to Shanti Niketan. See here, she is telling that Shanti Niketan is about 100 kilometers away from her hometown. Away from her hometown. Krishna Nagar in Central West Bengal. Krishna Nagar in West Bengal. Central West Bengal. That day Baba woke me up at 5 in the morning. By the time I got ready, Ma had prepared some snacks. We quickly got into the car. Driver uncle told us that it will take us around 3 hours to reach Shanti Niketan. See that day Baba. Baba means what? Father. Her father waked her at 5 o'clock in the morning. By the time she got ready, her mother prepared the, some snacks. And the driver uncle said that it takes the time for 3 hours to reach the Shanti Niket. And they quickly got into the cars and driver uncle said that 3 hours. It takes 3 hours to reach the Shanti Niket. As the car moved out of the town, I looked at the vast stretch of golden paddy fields. There were just a few people here and there. The winter sun was shining bright. And it was turning a little hot. See what happened as the car moved out of the town. How we will be telling that outer ring road like that we are telling now. They also, they have reached the outer, out of the town. And they looked the vast stretch golden paddy. Paddy means what children? The field. You know the field no? Yes or no? You know the fields? Yes, in that paddy field you know. The rice field children. Paddy means what? The rice crop. Yes. The rice crop field was there, no? That was looking like golden. The brown color. The rice will be inside the brown colored part. Yes, you love. Yes. See, they are seeing that golden color it was. There were just a few people here and there. There were just a few people here and there. The winter sun was shining bright and it was turning a little hot. The winter sun was shining and bright it was. Uh, and turning a little bit hot. After about two hours, we were all hungry. Baba saw a tea stall and asked driver uncle to stop. They were, after two hours, they were feeling very hungry. Then Baba saw, Baba means father. Father saw a tea stall and said driver uncle to stop the car. We climbed out and stretched out ourselves as driver uncle got us cups of tea and biscuits. Then what happened? They climbed out. Climbed out means they came out of the car and they stretched themselves. Then till that time, driver uncle got some cups of Tea and biscuits. Baba told me there was still an hour to go before we reached Shanti Niketan. Then Baba said, Father said that there is more one hour to reach the Shanti Niketan. Ma, whose good photographer, started clicking pictures of men and women going about their daily work. In the meantime, Baba ordered several plates of bread omelette. They were delicious. See here. And in one hour it takes the time. So what they have did the ma, mother. The mother was a good photographer. She was clicking the photos of the people who are going for the work. Men and women. They will be going for the work. No. For that people they will, she was clicking the photographs. So till that time Baba ordered the bread omelettes. Several plates of bread omelette. They came and it was very delicious. We started our journey again. And ma began to sing as she looked out of the window. After eating the bread omelette, they have started the journey again. 
and ma began to sing ma means who mother began to sing as she looked out of the window we just murmur no children when we are traveling how we will feel by the car wherever we want we can stop the car yes and we can see the nature outside nature how it is see here the sky was shining blue and the fields were all green and golden the flowers of the gulmohar tree formed a red roof across the road it was beautiful what happened children here the sky was the sky was very yes the sky was shining blue and the fields were like in green and golden color the flowers of gulmohar tree what is gulmohar children with bright red flowers usually they will be having no you can see nearby your houses that gulmohar tree formed a red roof the red color flower tree will be there no they are across the road they were there it was very beautiful by 9 o'clock we reached shantini ketan and went straight to the ravindra bhavan museum i was absolutely wide eyed as the guide took us around and one by one opened doors to go times gone by see what happened by 9 o'clock they reached the shantini ketan and went straight to the ravindra bhavan museum they went to the ravindra bhavan museum i was absolutely wide eyed she is telling that she was absolutely wide eyed means her eyes became wide that guy took him round and round one by one the doors were opening the time gone by he narrated stories of the great poet and writer he narrated the stories of the great poet narrator rabindranath tagore you know everyone knows rabindranath tagore natural right yes tagore had spent most of his life in shanti niketan and had founded the famous vishwabharati university vishwabharati university tagore had spent means he spent his time most of the time in shanti niketan and he founded the famous university vishwabharati university it was the vision vision means what his wish you can tell as admiration or some his wish okay children what it is his wish you can tell or the idea great thought everything you can tell that okay and that transformed bolap bolapur from a little town into an international educational center that is known as shanti niketan today his vision means his idea transformed bolapur from the little town into the international education system international education system center that is known as shanti niketan okay children i was thrilled to look at the manuscripts of tagore's poem and songs it was thrilled with surprise you can tell us that manuscripts manuscripts means what the scripts which is written by hand okay children which is written by hand written by the hands old documents written by the hands will be there not that one and the tagore's poems and songs ma hummed some songs of rabindra sangeet as we moved from one room to another ma mother has hummed hummed means singing like prompting the song some songs of rabindra sangeet yes rabindra sangeet the rabindranath's poem she was started to sing okay has she moved from one room to another by the time we finished exploring the museum and the vast campus around it we were all tired and thirsty what happened they finished exploring all the museum and the vast campus around it what happened they were tired and very thirsty then driver uncle suggested that we go and have lunch he took us to a quiet little place to eat here the driver uncle suggested that we will go for a lunch and they took he took them to a quiet little place to eat quiet little place means a small a picture square a small place they went from the outside it looked nothing like a restaurant we were all confused by seeing that it like it is was a small hut type of it is house it is not looking like a restaurant or it can't can, they are very confused about seeing that baba asked are you sure that we will get food here see baba father asked that are you sure that we will get food here the driver uncle gave a small smile and walked briskly towards the clay hut he called out kamala four meals please what happened here driver uncle gave some smile so he smiled like small he smiled and he walked briskly what it is inactive and quick he energetic he was very energetic and he walked to the small mud hut and he said kamala four meals please soon kamala auntie came out of the hut with her two daughters we sat on a mat under a jackfruit tree right outside her house she then served us delicious home cooked for food for lunch 
then while the driver uncle called there kamala for miss so soon kamala auntie came out of the hut with her two daughters and we sat they sat under the jack fruit you know na children jack fruit tree they sat under a jack fruit tree and kamala auntie served a delicious home cooked food it was very delicious food she served i did not know that a one day trip would have so many so many new experiences to offer Kamala auntie was a very inspiring woman she cooked daily for her family as well as for the tourist i played for some time with her daughters then driver uncle told us that it was time to leave then she don't know that she don't know that one day trip would have so many experiences of to offer and kamala aunt was very inspiring what is inspiring children inspiring means encouraging inspiring means encouraging yes children and what happened she cooked daily for her fam not only for her family she is cooking for the tourist who comes there and she played they played sometimes outside with her daughter she played and the driver uncle told that it is time to leave now then they have started next we headed to koi a dry forest region with red soil at koi we walked around as the rays of the afternoon sun fell on us hard they headed to the koi koi it was a dry forest region and it was with the red soil a koi we walked around they walked around as the rays of the afternoon sun fell on us the air carried a slight chill it was so calming that we felt sleepy the air was chill when we are walking on the in the sun very then what the air comes very chill means how we will feel we will feel very sleepy yes sir then it was very silent that they they felt to sleep we sat down to rest near a group of trees we heard the rustling of the leaves as the sonhuri sonhuri trees danced to tune of the breeze then what they did they sat down to take the rest then suddenly they heard a rustling of the leaves as the sonhuri trees danced what is sonhuri trees the yellow colored flower trees the yellow colored flower trees last with bright yellow colored flowers that are called as sonhuri trees they were dancing on the breeze the tiny yellow flowers fell on us and the whole forest seemed to be filled with gold the tiny yellow color flowers fall on them and it was full of on the road what what they felt they felt that the forest is filled with gold nearby the kopai river flowed to the rhythm of a trotting horse it was magical here what happened near that the kopai river is there which was floating to like a rhythm of a yes of a trotting means a, between a ra walking and running the small will be there no the sound that is that the jain sound okay and it was like a magical the rhythm was suddenly broken by the sound of foot bells then the rhythm was suddenly broken by the yes sounds of foot bells a ball troop had gathered on the backs of kopai to perform their songs and dance Driver uncle told us that the ball singers love to be close to nature. They travel around to perform their music. We listen to the music as the sun went down. Here the rhythm was suddenly broken by the foot bells. No, here the ball troop, a group of uh, spiritual singers, a group of spiritual singers, they had gathered near the banks of the Kopai River to perform some songs and dances. then driver uncle told that they will be coming here. They will be the ball singers will be interested to. together to be near the nature they will be every time they will be wanted to be close to the nature and they travel around to perform the music we listen to the music they have listened to the music when the sun went down time just flew soon it was time to go back home as our car moved out of santi niketan the dust red dust lingered behind as if say goodbye the red dust lingered means what it was showing like a, it was telling bye to us means the kurukmi was feeling that the forest is telling the bye okay i have such wonderful memories of the day i wonder which place we will explore on our trip this year see this was the last year's trip and she was wondered that which trip now they wanted to be going means saying uh, all this how the shantini ketan was there the rukmi felt how it is okay shantini ketan how it is and the rabindranath tagore's manuscripts okay children the koi forest dry forest and kopai river and the ball singers were singing very nice and they were doing the dance very nicely at last the time was finished 
they wanted to come back the time is to come back to the home then they reach it to the home and she was feeling that now this year where we will be going rukmi was felt like that. rukmi was feeling like that and as a children now see what we have done we have completed our trip to shantini ketan explanation now tell me the answers where and with whom did rukmi go on a trip yes she went to shantini ketan with the family what did baba ordered several plates of several plates of omelet she ordered several plates of omelet where did the family go after where did the family go after visiting the museum they went for yes after visiting the museum they where they went to see the book yes see ya <clears throat> after visiting the museum they went to the they have looked around and they went to spend in the <clears throat> vishwabharati university and they have turned around okay children now where did the family go after visiting the museum over what was the koi region like yes it was like a yes see a koi region was like a dry forest region with red soil here you can write where did the family go after visiting the museum you can write that they went for lunch or they can you can write that to around the campus okay children now by this we have completed our lesson explanation understood and you read the lesson and write lud questions meanings in your book okay children new words meanings in the class work lud questions in your homework book everyone will do that complete the work and complete the book notes understood children everyone complete the notes with neat handwriting without any mistakes